into the red corner. Representing Team Watson, Smoking on Watson. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome his opponent across the ring into the blue corner. Representing the Spartans Jim Carl the This is about six on the series program, and this bet has been sponsored by JVH Building Services. This is a lightweight contest, and we'll be deciding over three two-minute rounds of EBA action as we reintroduce your boxes. Please welcome once again boxing out of the red corner, wearing the black shorts with the three gold stripes and the black waistband representing Team Watson Smoking Bird Watson <laughs> and his opponent across the ring boxing out of the blue corner with the black and white shorts with the silver trim and the black, white, and silver waistband. Representing the Spartans Jim Carl Ladies and this contest will try to free to many rounds of lightweight action. Your referee, Mr. Colin Payne. Thank you. So we have smoking Burt Watson from Team Watson. Five fights, four wins. Versus Kyle McCarthy from Spartans Gym. I don't have Kyle's record. So we'll soon see what level of experience he's got when the action starts. This guy's looking light and sharp. And Kyle is obviously not a novice. He's, uh, he looks reasonably experienced in the way he moves, the way he guards himself. Nice explosive punching. Smoking Bert Watson looks uh, very composed. Low front hand guard. Can't try to make, uh, take advantage of that. Get inside it quickly. Oh, nice shot from McCarthy there. Good left hand. McCarthy is southpaw. Looking to throw that left hand. Looks like he's strong. Smoking Burt. Landing some good straight front hands. Oh, I think that, uh, that body shot certainly took a little bit of a toll. Oh, strong shots there from Smoking Burt. Landing right on the jaw of McCarthy. Just behind those those gloves, sneaking in there. Both precise punches here. Very precise, not wasting anything, either man. Both these guys tough as well. Punches landing, doesn't seem to have any effect.
Both prepared to stand and mix it up as well. Often you draw a bit of a stalemate when you have a South Paul versus Orthodox. McCarthy taking it to Smoking Burt. The referee's going to give him a standing count. Yes, he is. Right at the end of the round. Excellent time to score a standing count. Judges certainly won't forget that. And I expect McCarthy to be getting in there trying to take advantage of that standing out count, standing eight count towards the end of the last round. And smoking Bert Watson coming out strongly himself. Trying to make amends. It's often very dangerous to attack a, a fighter who's had a standing eight count, especially if you attack recklessly. That fighter is going to be looking to make amends for that count. Both fights were very even in, until, the, until that little surge towards the end. That body shot that had a fantastic effect there. I think smoking Burt Watson is going to struggle to cope with those body shots. Paul McCarthy obviously knows that's a, a weak area. I think you can be sure you can see shots going in there. And of course, there they are. There they are. And the referee calls it off. And that's how quickly it can all change. One moment it looks evenly matched. The next moment someone lands a telling blow. And the pendulum swings. I have to say that was good work from Carl McCarthy. Very precise, very accurate. But smoking jump, sorry, smoking Bert Watson was doing well up until the point he was uh, he was hurt. And now what the decision wins the move. to the centre of the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, in one minute and four seconds of the second round, your winner by TKO in the blue corner.